Many children fell ill and the lack of adequate medical care resulted in a high mortality rate. The very walls of these institutions echoed with the cries of children longing for the warmth of their homes, their families. But the affliction wasn't just physical, it was psychological, it was emotional. The children were stripped of their cultural identity, their language, their customs and forced to adapt to an alien way of life. They were punished for speaking their native tongue, for practicing their traditions. They were molded, coerced into the image of what was deemed civilized, acceptable. The abuse didn't stop at cultural assimilation. Many children were subjected to physical and mental abuse. They were treated not as children, but as subjects, as objects of an experiment of forced assimilation. 